guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new then welcome in about three months um, my son will be two years this old. diaper bag video has been highly requested for the few people who do request video so I should have got this video up a long time ago but I have slacked but I feel like I really know what I need in a diaper bag bag person like before I had Brantley I didn't really carry purses um, I just hate to have something that I have to keep up with and I don't like stuff on my shoulders like purses just are not my thing. I knew right away when I got pregnant that of course I would have to carry a bag so I was like I thought about it and I really wanted a backpack. He's waking up. I really wanted a backpack diaper bag just because I feel like it holds a lot and can just put it on my back and I don't have to worry about it because when you have a child on your hip, the last thing you need is some big bag on your shoulder. So the backpack is totally clean. Um, I got this backpack diaper bag off of Amazon. There's so many diaper bags to choose from and so many different price ranges. I think I paid around 40 or $50 for this one and I love it and even if I don't use it as a diaper bag I can use it as a bag for myself I've had diaper bags that were just for diaper bag like Eddie Bauer brand and stuff like that but I wanted something that was more like not just babyish and something that was just neutral came with a ton of different straps so I don't have to just use it as a backpack I can use it as like a messenger bag I can use it in a lot of different ways so I really like this about this. Let's show you what's in my bag. Okay, so it has these front pockets right here and I'm not even sure. This is just like my everyday use. Like I didn't organize or clean this diaper bag before the video. Um, so nothing is in these two front pockets because you can put stuff, but it's just really tight. So sometimes I might would sit my phone there, but nothing is in me. So on the side right here, it has the zippers. And usually I have um, those things like Chick-fil-A has. I usually get them at Walmart or Amazon. Um, and they are super, super convenient for when we go out to eat. And I always store those right here so I can just unzip it and pull one out and it's right there and then also I carry two of the plastic bibs that I can just wipe down when we go out to eat or something and um, just put those on Brantley and they're super easy and I just store them right there so it's easy and grab because the restaurant can be pretty chaotic with Brantley sometimes so I definitely need grab and go okay and then on this side I just have some hand sanitizer because when we're eating and stuff, you know, grab and go, like I said. Usually, this Burt's Bees um, Burt cloth is in here, but I took it out because I have to wash it. So this is just like eating storage and super convenient. So then right here in the back, we have this zipper, which is mommy's spot, which I love this because my wallet is like hid away, so I keep my wallet in there. And then I have this bag, which is mommy's bag. And in here, I have some rubber bands. I have some tampons. You never know. I have some lip gloss. And speaking of, I keep a chapstick, I thought, in these pockets. So, why did I not fill it? I think it's in this one. It is. And I keep a chapstick on, which I need because my lips are really chapped. So, I guess Brantley went back to sleep. Thank goodness. Anyways, what's up? Then I have a pack of gum because fresh breath always, you know. And then I have a Target receipt. Then I have my YMCA card. 
which needs to go in my wallet. And that is what I keep in the diaper bag for myself. And sometimes I throw in other stuff if I need to. And this is just my compartment. It's out of the way and just easy to grab stuff. Right in here, a book. Then we have this diaper changing pad. And I've really never used it because I don't really change Brantley in public and I never really have. I usually just try to change them in my car, wait till we get home because that's just what I like to do. I have to make this snappy because he woke up. I don't even know why he's awake. He's been asleep for an hour maybe. Okay. So now we have some toys in here in the diaper bag. Um, I keep a baggie in my hall closet. Let me show you. Okay, I keep this baggie of um, toys. I also keep my diaper bag in my hall closet and it has the shoes and stuff that I just open. I just like. A lot of stuff that I walk out the door with Brantley with, I keep in my hall closet because I don't want to have to go walk around to his bedroom and everywhere and just grab stuff when I'm walking out the door. And it has extra diapers and also at like Chick-fil-A and stuff when he gets these coloring things and stuff like that, I keep them. Um, and just depending on like where we're going, I can switch stuff out. So like in the diaper bag right now, I'm running low. And I only have two diapers in there. So I keep diapers in here. So when I go to get the diaper bag and I see that I'm missing some diapers, I will just grab them so I don't have to go all the way to his room. And anyways, I just keep a baggie of toys that I consider to be diaper bag toys. Because I keep all Brantley's toys in his room like together as to what they are and organized. Which I'm going to do an organized video so I will share all that with you. But these are the diaper bag toys, so I like to keep them together because I'm OCD like that. Just, I don't want to clutter the diaper bag with a ton of toys, and I don't always need toys when we go places. So, I just, like, pretty much rotate or just grab toys if I know that I'm going to need toys, if that makes sense. In my bag, I have um, this Itsy Ritzy bag, which I have lots of the, like, travel bags. I don't know if they're like, I guess wet bags you could call them, kind of. And I just keep snacks in this one. So I just always like to have snacks because you just never know if you're going to get in a situation where you just need snacks. I mean, snacks are life anyways. And they're so good at occupying Brantley, so I always keep snacks. So I have this applesauce little pouch thing. And then I have like some goldfish, but usually I don't have this big box. I usually, what I do is just Ziploc bag everything. So like this is pretzel. So usually I'll Ziploc bag like, I don't know, goldfish and stuff like that. And I'll just have like a lot of Ziploc bags in here, which usually saves more room. But for some reason I have like this bulky stuff right now. Anyways, I have these little Gerber puffs, but Brantley doesn't really like them. He's never really liked the Gerb, the puffs really too much. So I don't even know like why I have them, but. All right, so this is like the snack bag. Then we have another book to go with the toys, lots of books. And then we got these little rattle toys. And then I got this, which has some like no tissues and some, this is called, I guess I'll take it out. This is called like Clean Smart. Um, it's disinfectant spray, kills germs, no harsh chemicals, and you don't have to rinse or wipe it off, which would be great if Brantley sucked passies, but he doesn't. And then I got this Baby Ganix, just travel size um, lotion, and sometimes Brantley can stink and smell like slobber, so we gotta freshen them up, you know. Then I got this Tide to Go pen because, you know, he spills stuff on me, I spill stuff on me, he spills stuff on him, and Sometimes you just need a tie to go pin. 
then luckily we've never had to use this but this is a first aid kit and it just has like band-aids and gauze and cleansing wipes and um, you know all the good stuff that you would need in case you got a boo-boo which Brantley is walking and dangerous and climbing and luckily we haven't had to break that out yet so this is just like the essential bag in case I need something out of here. Moving on, I have a, another rubber band and then I have um, some diaper rash cream, it's Burt's Bees, which I'm kind of out of this in his bedroom so I might need to put it in his room until I buy some more. So then in this zipper part right here, I have some of these bags so when I go somewhere I can put his stinky diaper in it and don't have to stink up somebody's house or somebody's business or a restaurant or wherever I'm at, you know. And then these are just some um, wipes um, that I think I got when I like registered or something and I've never used them so I was like I was gonna throw them away the other day when I was cleaning out a whole bunch of like sample stuff that I got when I was pregnant and I was like girl put these in your diaper bag and use them for backup in case you forget to replace them when they run out gotta think ahead you know so then there's like all kinds of compartments in here for um like your bottles and it's insulated and then all these compartments and i like keep my diapers and stuff in one of those one of like the pockets and then a lot of times i like sit sippy cups and stuff in here all these bags just slide in there but the diaper bag i can see if i can try to like link it for y'all but it comes with a ton of different straps which is super super nice and usually I don't review anything on Amazon, but I was gonna leave this a review when I bought it like a couple of months ago, but I forgot. But I might do that after I make this video. But it's really the perfect diaper bag. I will probably use this with our next child um, because I love it. And it's just like, it doesn't look like a diaper bag. And that's, okay, and you know that's, kind of like the goal I was going for is for it not to look all the way like a diaper bag because sometimes mama just wants to be mama and not just always got baby stuff like I already have to wear my hair up because he pulls it and I have to have slobber on me and like messy clothes and look tired so at least I can do is have a stylish bag right I mean come on I hope that it helps you figure out what to put in your diaper bag but yeah Anyways, guys, so I hope you all enjoyed my video, What's in My Diaper Bag, and I hope that you will subscribe if you're not already, and please give this video a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel and you just found this by searching for What's in My Diaper Bag on YouTube, then please check out some more of my videos. I will list them down below. I am getting married soon and I have a almost two year old and we will be adding to our family within this year. So very shortly we will be adding to our family and I'm so excited just to share everything with y'all. So please don't forget to subscribe, check out some more videos I have, give this video a thumbs up and please comment below. Let me know some things that you put in your diaper bag or you suggest that I should put in my diaper bag. Just leave it below and let me know. I love talking with you guys and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye guys!